bone in pork chops. Some people don't eat pork. We love pork in this house. Um, club size savings is so much better. Uh, I got them at ShopRite. I mean, my husband eats one and a half. The kids each eat one and I eat one. Depends on what the sides are. But I'm gonna marinate these in a Ziploc baggie with a little bit of robust Italian dressing, some salt and pepper and some fresh herbs. And then we're gonna pan fry them. Pork chops, Ziploc baggie. I use Italian dressing. I chopped up some fresh parsley, a little bit of adobo. I'm going really light on salt though because when you use the bottom dressings, they do tend to have salt in them. And adobo itself has salt. So all you want to do is take the bag and shake it on up so it coats and marinates the whole thing. So big frying pan on and our pork chops that we're marinating in the bag. I am literally taking us. I'm going to do this on both sides and then I'm going to drizzle a little bit of the marinade on top, put it on a sheet pan and pop them in the oven and actually finish them in the oven. I got Logan feeling hard boiled eggs over there. Snacks for the week. More chops. And I'm pan searing them because I know, like I said, I'm going to finish them in the oven. But there's so much more flavor by doing it this way. But I do want them fully cooked and I don't, my kids won't eat it if it's too dark on the outside. So that's why we'll finish it in the oven. And actually I put some bratwurst there as well that I pan sear first. It's in the oven. Well, I got potatoes on because I'm making mashed potatoes. And our pork chops are going. And I'm going to baste that chicken. And then probably another 15 minutes and we're going to get it covered. The pork chops smell amazing. And the bratwurst. Let's get them all turned. 